To find the grammar and spelling bug resources that have been allocated to your child, click on My Stuff and click on the grammar and spelling bug icon to display them. Here you will see that three resources have been allocated by this child's teacher. You will see a number at the bottom of each. This represents the number of coins this unit is worth. Pupils can earn these coins for completing the unit and they can then spend them in the My Rewards area. Let's launch the unit on possessive apostrophes, which you'll see has already been opened by the child. On the left of the screen, you'll see the Time Hopper bug, who gives a brief introduction to the topic. Click on More to read what he has to say. Underneath it, you'll see a video icon. This is the video tutorial that explains the aspect of spelling, grammar or punctuation that you're learning. To the right, you'll see links to a series of fun activities and games designed to help your child put what they've learned into practice. To start each unit, click on the video to watch the tutorial. This explains the aspect of spelling, punctuation or grammar, in this case, possessive apostrophes. It explains it in a nice, clear way, including how and when to use it. So let's close that for now. Once your child has watched the tutorial, they're then ready to have a go at the activities and games. I've already completed the first activity, so it's prompting me to, uh, to continue or to cancel. So I'm going to move on to launch the second one. Once you're in a game, you'll see the instructions at the top of the screen. Click the cross to close this. Click start to begin the game and then follow the instructions on screen to find out what you need to do. Children will be marked instantly so they'll know whether or not they've got it right and if they've got it wrong first time they'll be prompted to have another go. There are multiple activities within each game Once the child has completed all of the activities, they should fi click Finish, and this will take them back to their home screen. If you need to leave in between activities, once a whole activity has been completed, it will be saved, so you can leave and come back later or the next day to do the next activity if you wish. <laughs>